Hey everyone, welcome to another Waifu Wednesday. This time around we have, yes, we have another Goddess Story 10 MO box. I am super excited to open this. I am in love with the 10 MO boxes. This one's really mangled and I ordered this one, uh, man, many, 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 many months ago and I'm finally getting into it. This is the 10 MO2 box. I think I previously opened up the MO1 and the MO4, I think. I'm not sure if I have an MO3. Maybe I already opened that one. Um, let's see here. This one doesn't really have any example. Okay, so yeah, there's some example cards. So yeah, this came out last year, apparently. Um, that's really, really nice. These 10 MO boxes are just really fun. Really hope I get some good cards. I hope this has the clear FR cards. Hope I get this card. And yeah, let's dive right in here. Hopefully uh, you guys have been enjoying these videos. I know I generally enjoy opening up the boxes. I haven't had any stinkers lately, so I'm very pleased about that. Um, it's always fun to dive back into Goddess Story as those were the first sort of boxes I opened. And yeah, it's good to see this series still going, even though I'm trying to short, sort of shy away from buying boxes as they appear because it is just a money pit um but it is fun to open up in front of you guys and it's fun to hear what you guys think and i like sharing this with y'all so yeah let's take a look all right so this series this this box definitely has a sort of asian inspired nice fancy outfits um not really kimono style, but just like really fancy Chinese outfits, it looks like. So yeah, let's dive right into these. Um, I'm scared that I'm gonna like these because I, like I said, I don't really feel like buying more boxes. And if I do like this and I do wanna buy more boxes, then I'm worried that they're not gonna have them in print anymore because that's tends to happen. Um, and that's a little bit why there's that FOMO of like, yeah, I gotta buy the boxes as soon as I see them, but I need to start getting away from that. So yeah, here we go. Right off the bat, we got those SR cards and thankfully it is 10 MO2. I found out that the, I think it was with that 10, even the 10 MO1 had like older cards in it from like the two series or maybe the five series. Good old Pokemon trainer. And yes, indeed, we do have the FR cards. Amazing. That is an excellent one. And I think this is a parallel because it has that sort of colored foil. I think normally it's just gold foil. That is a really nice one. Excellent. And an SSR. That's right. This series, you get a FR card and an SSR card, which is amazing. All right. Pack two. Regular SR card. This is from Arknights. That's a cool one. This is from uh, Girls Frontline. Cool looking art. And another FR. See, there's that gold, regular gold, fo gold foil. Very nice. And I got a, what is this? This doesn't have a number. Oh, MR, okay. Yeah, usually you get like one MR per box and that's not too bad. Having not known what types of cards you can get, I don't know what I should be disappointed in not getting. Like I didn't get that yearning card out of that one box. But it does fit that theme. It's got that nice like cherry tree stuff going on. All right, pack three. All right, pretty cool SR. Another pretty cool one. 
Oh, like a vampire and a pretty good FR card. Very nice. And the SSR, we got a nice Halloween themed one. Alrighty, pack four. Here we got a pretty derby. I know this character. I don't know the character, but I know the series finally. And a really nice one up here. Thankfully, I haven't seen any from an older series. And a nice FR card. A creepy doll. And a, another MR card. Interesting. I got two MR cards. And it's sort of fitting the theme of the box. Interesting. Hmm. Alrighty. Pack number five. Got a dupe already, fortunately. Another dupe, a FR card of OTS 14, which I think is probably Girls Frontline. And the ghost is trying to stop me from opening cards. And a SSR, oh nice. All right, pack number six. Dupe of that one, dupe of that one, yeah, so getting a lot of dupes here. Wow, okay. Decent FR. Gotta love the offset yin yang we got going on here. And the SSR, not too bad on theme with the box. All right, pack seven, lucky seven. Good one, I like that art style. Very nice. And a pretty good FR card. Some weird got a war style writing and a pretty crazy cool SSR. At that. All right, pack number eight. At least the goddess story cards are pretty consistent, gotta say. Decent. Art's always pretty good. Costs aren't too bad. The FR cards are always fun. Not sure what's going on with this plane. Interesting. And a pretty crazy SSR with the writing there. All right, pack nine. Dupe of that one, that one looks new. Decent FR card, that symbol again. And a wild SSR. Interesting. 
And pack number 10. Dupe of that one, dupe of that really nice one, dupe of that one, and the FR card. Hey, look at that. I got the cover girl or the box girl. Nice. Wow, that's a first of me actually calling it out and getting it. And that is a really nice one. It's with the drones. Weird. Oh, a bummer. What is this? Weird. Weird thingy here and the SSR. Not sure who that is. Cool. All right, moving right along to the second half here. I'm just gonna take these out because this box is really annoying me because look how mangled that is. All right, pack number 11. All righty, it's a new one. At least I'm getting some new cards here. Sounds cool. Dynamic. And the FR. That one's pretty good. And a lot of this symbol. What is that from? Don't know. And the SSR. Kitty, cat. Oh, these do have like patterns on them. Interesting. I didn't notice that before. All right, pack 12. Oh, these are new. Still getting new cards. This is a big set. FR card. I'm trying to remember, I think I got a full set of FRs in one of my, I think I bought two boxes and got a full set. All right, uh, 13, lucky 13. That one's nice, simple art. I mean, not too simple, just really nice art. This is a good set. Again, the 10 MO boxes are always really pretty good quality, I have to say. And a pretty good FR card. Keeping with the theme. And the SR. SSR, I mean. All right, sorry. Pack 14. Dupes, yeah, starting to get dupes. I think that one's me. If I'm being honest, I hate I feel like I haven't got a ton of dupes. Maybe I just jinxed myself, but I don't know. Is that the girl from that Nintendo game? The RPG? SSR. All right, 15, I think. Very easy for me to lose track of my county here. That one's fun with the bubble gum that shines like that. It's a nice one. Dupe of that. FR, pretty good. Again, with the on theme. Ooh, SSR. 
All right, 16. Yeah, I think there's 18 packs in here usually. More Pretty Derby, I'm pretty sure. Maybe, or is that Arc Knights? I don't know, I lose track. Still getting new cards though. Sure, what those foil stamping is supposed to be. All right, penultimate pack number seventeen here. Dupes of the first pack I opened, pretty much. I think. I guess I'm not sure about that one. And then these are different. That's a crazy SSR. What's this thing all about? The Rhode Island girl. Who is that? Arknights, I think, maybe. Someone help me out. Pretty good card. And the final pack, pack number 18. Let's get a another MR card or some other rarity. Dupes of these. That's a new one, and it looks like I did get a new MR card. <laughs> yeah, this is a, a, no, this is a BGL card, and this looks like, oh, who is this character? It looks familiar, but look at that card. Wow, look at that fun, like, cherry blossom art down there. Wow, that's a fun one. Even though, I don't, even though I don't know who this character is, Goddess Story does a really good job with their like upper tier cards. They just make them stand out. They do these different foil. I mean, there's green and red foil stamping. I mean, look at these ones. These are fun too. So yeah, that is the Goddess Story 10 MO2 quality set. I gotta love getting these types of cards. These are always fun, these clear cards. So yeah, I definitely recommend this set. Let me know which your favorite was. Not really sure which was my favorite right now off the bat here. Um, kind of just good all around. Not sure, like I said, not sure I have an ultimate favorite here. So let me know what you think and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks everybody.